The arrest of Manzoor Pashtin, a Pashtun leader from northwest Pakistan, has sparked widespread protest and demonstrations. And these events are not just confined to Pakistan, but the anti Pakistan slogan ring has resonated with the Pashtuns and other right groups living in different parts of the world too. They are demanding an immediate release of their leader, who was arrested on 26th January and was slapped with charges of sedition. These people accuse Pakistan government of muzzling a democratic voice of dissent that has successfully exposed the barbaric duo of civil and military rulers. This decision of the Pakistani establishment has uh, uh, provided an opportunity for the Pashtun nation uh, to be united and uh, uh, work for a common cause uh, to be released from the cruel cr clutches of the Punjabi uh, establishment and regime. This government of uh, Pakistan, the present government of Pakistan, uh, it's not a democracy. Uh, it is a fascism and dictatorship under complete control of the Pakistani army. They are violating uh, the, the basic fundamental rights of the Pashtun people. The arrest of Manzoor Pashtin is the latest in the line of Pakistan's reflexive response to any of dissent that gathers traction and becomes threat to its essentially autocratic rule. Manzoor Pashtin has successfully mobilized hundreds of thousands of people against the Pakistani government that has not just been treating them as second-class citizens, but has unleashed brutality against them. The movement he leads, or Pashtun Tahfuz movement, seeks justice for those who have been abducted, arrested and tried on false charges. It also demands a free and fair inquiry into the extrajudicial killings by Pakistan Army in the name of fighting terrorism in northwest Pakistan. The little list of demands seeks a full stop at the torture and humiliation they endure every day. But sadistic rulers in Islamabad are not ready to concede to even these demands, which would have not suffered even single day of delay in any other democratic part of the world. The state of Pakistan is so afraid of peaceful activists and peaceful activism in the country. Everyone who believes in the promotion and protection of fundamental human rights, everyone who believes on peace, development of the people, he is being leveled as a traitor and unpatriotic in Pakistan. The Pashtun movement, which began as a small demonstration by eight students of Gomal University, demanding removal of landmines from Waziristan, gained prominence in 2018 after Nakibullah Mahsud, a modeling aspirant, was killed in a fake encounter staged by the police officer Rao Anwar. Earlier, it was Mahsud movement, but the word was replaced with Pashtun to refer and represent all Pashtuns. Manzoor Pashtin became the face of the movement. The establishment was critical and made several failed attempts to nip it in the bud. After all its tactics failed, it launched a crackdown against prominent figures in the movement. The arrest of Manzoor Pashtin might have come as a blow to the months-long resistance of Pashtuns, but the movement has gained another component in the form of international audience, which will definitely see the movement from close and park brutalities from closer.